Warning, the following video contains spoilers from AMC's The Walking Dead. Hi there. They call me the governor, and I think we're still reeling from Eugene's sacrifice to save Max last week. Plus, all the other shit that went down. And of course, we need to know why Rosita was attacked and apparently bagged. Is it Lance looking for revenge? Is it Pamela not being satisfied with just Eugene? Or is it some new group who will capture a bunch of our people and torture them by making them watch Halloween ends? And will we see more variants? I'm thinking if the Commonwealth starts having to deal with smart biters, those wussy little clone troopers will run like hell. Now hopefully this week's episode, which is number 20, will provide some answers. What's been lost is the title. So let's get into this. Who knows, maybe Mercer will actually pick a side. Stranger things have happened. Time to react. Laya. Carol. Uh, heartbreaking moments. And badass moments. Ah, uh, Carol. I wouldn't be so sure. Well, that bread looks good. Probably fake. Ah, all hail the king. Here's some extra medical supplies to take back. That was nice. Whoa. If he was taken, that was too fucking quiet. Oh shit. <laughs> I think you're gonna take Carol. She knows how to get away. Shit, they got the Commonwealth flags. They are making some changes. Oh, and there's the Commonwealth. And a bunch of those clone pussies. Yeah, she's not running to the cops. Can't trust those motherfuckers. Well, that's not a good sign. Yeah. Everybody's gone. Damn. Ooh, blood. Oh, Daryl. <laughs> Wait a minute, he's got a knife in him. Twist that fucker. This guy's waking up pretty quick. Thought all his Commonwealth assholes were... Oh, there he's twisting. Does nobody hear the biter? Ha, certainly didn't hear Carol. Perfect. <laughs> Is that your friend? Well, you're dead anyway, so. <laughs> Migration uh, issues. Ooh, yeah, Yumiko, that's nice. Ha, ah, you tell her. <laughs> Bye, Karen. Oh, bullshit. He didn't kill Justice Sebastian, you bitch. No matter which side. Oh, seriously? You want her to prosecute well, Eugene? Eugene? That's well, what I just said. Oh, fucking you? threats. And let's Why don't we just kill her? Kill her now. Oh, you're gonna fucking threaten her brother, too. I really think you should just kill her. Come on, she's right there. They fucking took dog! God damn it! They must die. Uh, I don't know if he would or not. Is it ever? Well, the writers will help you out. Address him once a day. Or he'll turn into a fucking biter. Is I over that geeky? I don't think so. Removed from the Commonwealth. Black bagged. All of them. On Pamela's order. I want to see them again. It's like the fucking secret police. I imagine she threatened me too. You bet your ass. Is to give Pamela what she wants. Worst <laughs> advice what you ever. Find a justice waiting around the corner. <laughs> You're a little cynical, aren't you? 
Are we gonna see your daughter? Yeah, don't listen to your fucking brother. Oh, Connie? Damn. Good for you. She's always fucking thinking. Well, he looks like a prick. <laughs> you're damn right you're not. I don't know, you kind of stick out like a sore thumb. There goes one. Do you not notice that your friend is missing? Oh, now you do. Maybe take his gun too. Huh. Has he fucking lost it? Damn. Sebastian's a sloppy fucking eater. Sayonara. Damn. They call her a governor. Well, that's the way to get his fucking attention. Is she the good cop? I don't you tell us where our friends are. Or you're dead. Oh, she's the worst cop. I'll show you. Oh, really? You just went out of there. What is that? He's been tagged. <laughs> the radio frequency monitor. It's starting to off. You're going to have to cut off my foot. Yeah, that will speed things up. Did the alarm go off because they cut it off his leg? You know, maybe they could have waited till they're closer to the door. Don't worry, he's got immunity. He's got a spin-off. At least he's limping. Yeah, you're not obvious at all. You're totally fucking spotted. <laughs> yeah, you're not good at this at all. Hope you're a better lawyer. More than a transparent, open way. Also, yeah, such a bitch. Sorry. Max. Yes? Your boy has flown the coop. Oh, poor baby. I mean, I kind of feel you because of Penny, but this reminds me of a show I saw once. What was it called? Stomp. Yeah. The coin's new. Are you really trying to cozy up to Carol? Blowing mm. smoke up her ass. Anyway. <laughs> Bullshit. Hey, whoa. <laughs> I'm not lying to you. Same you're a fucking you. snake. Come on. <laughs> yeah, you're moving at full fucking speed. And then good luck finding your friends. You know, these guys don't know anything about fucking stealth. Another one of your brilliant plans, I'm sure. She's gonna prosecute him. This is a fucking conflict of interest. Definitely some kind of ethical violation. You meet to the fullest extent of the law and rest assured it's a fate I've already freely accepted. Yeah, we pretty much figured that. It's okay. This trial plays out where the governor reneges on her promise to set them free. I wouldn't be surprised. That is a piece of burden I simply can't help it with even for the truncated time I likely have left. <laughs> this he has fun. such a way with fucking words. Things look in this moment that this is not the end. Yeah, we still got what, four episodes okay. to go after this. Coming from a certain 
So this is your bright plan. Let's wait till nightfall. Kind of like you. I meant what I said back there. But I hope Dixon's all right. What, so he can save your fucking ass again? And then she could give you orgasms by touching your face. Even by bringing in your communities, which I own. Chauffeur's son. Does he ever fucking shut up? Till I find my people, there is no after. And I don't think she wants the responsibility. And then you're well It's not my problem. Exactly. Well, what about the kids? Well, you know, Carol hasn't really been that good with kids, like, ever. Ah, uh, here's some bitus. Would it be that bad if he got chomped? It's fucking useless. Carol can kill bitus in the dock. There you go. It's like a video game, damn it. Oh, that's helpful with the knife, with the light now. That's where the skin came from. Ugh. What are they just going for the uh, special effect awards? The lights went out, I thought you were right behind me. Oh, bullshit. Hope there's not any variants. Ah, oh, there you go. You are, uh, fucking screwed now. Well, uh, you didn't count on the Dick Dixon. Maybe Lance was sincere and wanted him to be okay. Yeah, Pam doesn't miss a fucking thing. Oh. Yeah. Though, of course, she could be lying. <laughs> well, there's an invitation to fuck things up. The Commonwealth will be moving forward with the of Eugene Porter's son, Sebastian. It wasn't murder, maybe manslaughter by Bida? Good evening. Good evening. Trouble in paradise. Well, it's kind of a. Geographic area. It's the incredible gift of a second chance. Yeah, she's totally right. This is fucking bullshit theater. Well, over the years, and even come to trust. And you still do trust them. That is why we always seek justice. Well, we yeah. Love. Someone who means she doesn't like this. And also That's right. Show them that ass. <laughs> That's pretty clever. Tommy is an invaluable and irreplaceable member of this community. Damn right. And the people of the Commonwealth. Except when he was a fucking baker. To defend Holy fuck. <laughs> nice. Karen doesn't look happy. Pam's not happy. I'm happy. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. We will not be taking any more questions. <laughs> Guess you gotta find a prosecutor now. For you, anyway. Then what? What are you like in charge, Lance? Connecting Make the biggest empire for the Fourth Reich ever. Connecting or conquering? What you want? Oh, does this think? What? Does this mean what I think it means? So you can't get there without. There's a train. You wait for it to come, and we see where it goes. You still need me? Not really. Because you wouldn't shut up. <laughs> yeah, Carol speaks truth. Ooh, you have a shot. Yeah, except uh, I don't think you'd be uh, very good at making a fair society. He's a frantic salesman. That would be a cool deal. Let's do it. And you could chase him. That'd be awesome, like a hunt. Run where? He's gone. He died back in that cell. You're so reformed, aren't you? Good. 
Good. Absolutely. I agree with Daryl for yeah, once. You might survive. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't count on it. Begging does not become you. They're letting him walk. Now, he's going to do something stupid. There he goes. <laughs> and they were expecting it. Bye bye, Lance, you fucking turd. Get your arrow back. Take the gun, too. Don't worry, Lance. You're going to come back as a biter. Maybe you can chomp Pamela. That was cool. Ciao. Oh, is this the fucking train? What, are they dextering them? Come on. Ooh. X-ray vision. You know, I wonder if the scar tissue from his surgery will uh, mitigate that shit or, you know. Oh, no, it's a bus. Where's this fucking train? It is good to know that of the options, none of those folks will have to watch Halloween Ends. But there was a whole lot to unpack this episode. Pamela taking all our people. So Yumiko will prosecute Eugene and obviously keep anyone from trying to break him out. Of course. Carol and Daryl managed to get away. Big surprise. But notice how quickly that guy Daryl killed, turned, told her Sebastian was super fucking lazy. And you know, even kind of got away for a while, but then was taken, supposedly. You know, Daryl and Carol went to that one guy, the one scumbag who knows how the Commonwealth works. And they used the old bad cop, worst cop routine on him. You know, but Lance is a bit of a drama queen, telling Daryl he has to cut off his foot. And it really knows how to piss off Pamela. It was bite a stomping time. <laughs> but while his help showed a smell of champion and Auntie Carol how to find those who were taken, well, he's not helping anyone else. <laughs> Even more than Sebastian, that fucker needed to die. And he's probably gonna turn. I hope it chomps into Pamela. She's a third rate governor. She couldn't even keep a reanimated kid around for more than a day or two. Do you know how long I cared for Penny? Now I think Pamela's gonna find things getting very tough for her. Now we only have four episodes left. So her power is bound to be gone in probably three. <laughs> and with Yumiko very publicly stating she was defending Eugene, just puts another wrench into the, her plans. I loved when Yumiko made Thomas stand up so everyone could see that he was a brother and very important to the community. So hopefully that will uh, be enough to dissuade Pamela from taking out her displeasure on him. And of course we hope Daryl and Carol can rescue, sorry Herschel, can rescue the friends and then, you know, take care of the governess. So anyways, don't miss the Walking Dead Reactors panel discussed in this episode in the even more detail. Those are streamed live on Mondays the day after the episode at 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. for you, Pacific time, folks. And leave some comments telling you what you thought of this episode and show your love for the Gov by subscribing if you haven't already. Hit that notification bell too. And you know, the like button would be nice. We will see you next week. Governor out. <laughs>